What's up guys, today we're going to be reviewing a Kingbow 45 watt LED grow light. You can pick up one of these LED panels on Amazon for about 30 US dollars. I'll make sure to include a link in the description in case you're interested. Uh, the product dimensions are 13 inches by 13 inches by about a half an inch and it includes hardware for hanging. The light panel has four triangle hooks on the back side that the included hardware will attach to and then you can hang something from there. If you hang them in the default configuration, you'll see that the entire light takes up almost one foot of vertical space. I recommend taking the cables and actually looping them around back onto the triangle hooks. Once you've done this, you've reduced the size by half and it gives you a little more vertical space. On the front of the LED panel, you'll see all 255 LEDs. The description says 45 watt LED grow light, but it actually only consumes 35 watts once it's running. I've seen other reviews where they put their hand on the back of the panel and they say it runs pretty cool, but I've found that it's actually pretty warm and almost uncomfortable to keep your hand on for more than a few seconds. Once you turn on the LED panel, you'll be able to see the pattern in which they have the LEDs laid out. This light panel targets the specific spectrum that plants usually use, so that's why it doesn't appear white like other lights. It's a very pink purplish color when you have it on. When you look closely, you'll notice that there are some very dim LEDs on this panel. Don't be alarmed, these are actually just infrared LEDs and they're very difficult to pick up with human eyesight, but they are indeed working. Here's a close up of the pattern the light gives off. Um, I, I have it overexposed just slightly just so you can kind of see the intensity of it and see the circle that it leaves behind. In this second example, you'll see that I've zoomed out more and also included dimensions of the boards. As I lift the light up, you can see how the light intensity and the light drop off change and you can kind of visualize the actual light pattern given off by this panel. In the right corner I included the actual camera exposure so you can also get an idea of how bright everything is. This is a genu plant that I've been growing under this light since germination. As you can see the leaves are very large and it's very green and has a very nice color. It's also not leggy. If you look at the inner stalk it's very thick and there isn't very much between each new leaf growth. Here's an avocado plant that I've been growing from seed since the very start under this light also. As you can see it's not leggy and it has nice growth. I actually have two of these lights and here's an example of all the plants that have been growing underneath it except for one other one which I couldn't fit on the table. Here's my actual setup. You can see everything's growing quite nicely. I think these lights are a pretty good bargain for only $30 and very low wattage yet they can produce pretty good results. Well that wraps up this review. I hope you guys enjoyed it and if you did maybe give it a like or subscribe. I've got a lot of other videos coming out so uh, stay tuned. See ya.